It was a wonderfully exuberant time, a golden Indian summer day, and both local baseball teams were in the World Series. At the tone, Pacific Daylight Time will be 5, 4, and 30 seconds. So the Oakland A's take... Take... Hey, you know what? We're having Word about the Bay Bridge. What about the Bay Bridge? What's wrong with it? The upper deck appears to have collapsed during that earthquake. Hold on a second. We are flying over the siphon structure right now. That section of highway that connects the Bay Bridge to 880. I don't believe it. Man. Ladies and gentlemen, your attention please. Power has been interrupted temporarily in the park. No power anywhere in the city. No phones, no word on how extensive the damage was. We are in the Marina District of San Francisco. It looks like part of an entire city block is burning. Please clear the area. We do not have enough medical personnel to be able to handle you if you get hurt here. Do not go home. Do your residence. Shook like it was just a piece of straw. Everything's gone. Lamps went and then it threw me off the chair. I can only describe the situation here as nightmarish. The entire city, at least the part of the city that I have been in all day, is completely blacked out. There are no traffic lights. Uh, civilians, if you were, are trying to direct traffic. People are wandering the streets aimlessly. It is, it is a horrible, sickening feeling to be in the city. I could only advise people to not come here under any circumstances. There was so much damage in San Francisco and Oakland that the area near the epicenter, the Santa Cruz Mountains, almost was forgotten. People in Hollister, Watsonville, and Santa Cruz felt left to fend for themselves. So many people felt helpless that night, no way of knowing where their loved ones were, whether their loved ones were even alive. Desperate messages scrawled on sheets of paper, the new homeless sleeping under the stars. For some, it took years to recover. For many, the emotional scars still remain.